let us derive area velocity relation for quasi one dimensional flow if you considering quasi one dimensional flow the flow properties are uniform throughout any given cross section and functions of x only let us take the differential form of conservation equation into the differential form it is d rho divided by rho plus du by u plus da by a is equal to 0 rho is density u is velocity and a is the area so from here d rho by rho is equal to d rho by d rho dp multiplied with dp by rho so from uh, Euler's equation, what Euler's equation says is dp is equal to minus rho u d. So dp by rho is equal to minus u d. And if the flow is isentropic. Then we can write this term dp by d rho is equal to dou p by dou rho for a constant isentropic uh, term. This is entropy, constant entropy is equal to a square. We see this term in speed of sound derivation. Now substitute this one and this one in here. We will get d rho by rho is equal to minus u du divided by a square. If you multiply and divide with u you will get minus u square du divided by a square u which is actually equal to minus m square du divided by u now in the differential form substituting we can write this term as minus m square du by u plus the equation du by u plus da by a is equal to 0 now 1 minus m square du by u equal to minus da by a m square minus 1 du by u is equal to da by a note for i uh, incompressible flow m is equal to 0 then this term then the this ratio will area in the area ratio will increase according to the negative of negative of the increase in the velocity or vice versa you can say this velocity increase can be the minus of area increase if Mach number is equal to 1 the whole term will be equal to be 0 but that's not possible so we can say um, physically only possible term is da by a can reach the minimum value that means we call it as throat in the nozzle so if m is equal to 1 it will be the minimum area we will call it as throat now if m is greater than 1 
then we will have the this ratio increasing with this ratio 